personal setting, if I may, and let's bring the conversation to Nigeria. I've looked across the Nigerian press, I've listened to people uh, from the National Assembly, and I've also looked at some records coming out of the courts in your country and in America as well, and there are serious allegations concerning you and your family and corruption and kickbacks. Now, are you prepared to face those charges and to give a full accounting? I'm very, very much so. Very much so. And if you have any evidence, Steve, please show it to me, and I will defend myself anywhere in the world. Well, because let, what let, you are right, saying let, is, let's, let's... is absolute nonsense. Without due respect, I am the only leader in Nigeria that has been examined and reported upon by the anti-corruption uh, bodies in Nigeria. I am the only one. When, we your, are when your successor took over, he yes. described corruption in the country as endemic, and he said it was the country's elite that was responsible. Well, he's one of them. One he's of one, what? He's one of Nigeria's elite. Well, of course he is, and he's saying, yes. as he takes over and yes. looks at what is happening inside government, yes. there is corruption to the very top. That now, doesn't, doesn't reflect that, well on you. If he said that, did he mention of Basanjo? Did he mention of Basanjo, Steve? But you were the president. I you am were responsible president. for the governance no, of your country. No, you I am not responsible for the corruption of all every Nigerian. Not every I'm Nigerian, not. but yes. you are in the now, end the uh, chief now, executive now, of a country please, which your own successor please, says is Steve, endemically you have, corrupt. You have made strong allegations against me personally well, I, and I, against my family. I'm coming to and that. And you have, I'm no, coming, I'm you coming have to no way to substantiate it. Substantiate it. Let's, and if not that this is something let's where talk. you are taking undue advantage, no, let's, I will have even say that. Let, let's talk. I will go beyond here. Well, let's talk specifically yes. then. Say, uh, Halliburton also. and yes. various Halliburton subsidiaries yes. have paid vast amounts of money in fines in the yes. United States because of bribes and corruption paid out to Nigerian officials. And yes. if one takes now, the testimony... Are, yes. Are those Nigerian officials, am I one of them? Well, let's talk about that. Yes. Am Albert, I one of them, Albert Steve? Jack Stanley confessed yes. last year in yes. the United States to bribing, and this is according to a U.S. Yes. court document, yes. quote, yes. three successive holders of a top-level office in the executive branch of the Nigerian government. He negotiated yes. with these office holders' representatives yes. regarding the amount of bribes that would be paid. Yes. Now, if one cross-checks that, I'm coming to that, yes. if one cross-checks that with yes. the testimony before a French prosecutor, yes. Jeffrey Tesla, yes. another Halliburton yes. agent involved, yes. I'm sure you know these names, yes. Yes. he named you as one of three successive Nigerian heads of state.